Hi everyone, I'm Tony from Russia. Have you seen Watch Hour of Turkey by Leonardo D'Alessandri? If so, look again. If no, you have to look. Link in the description. I will wait. Nearly 5 million views for September 2018, 47,000 likes and 2,000 comments. Filmed in 2014, it still looks great today. What makes this video so cool? Let's have a look. The idea, old as the world, but try to do it in the same way as Leonardo did. And it's not just about the great post-production. This work is an example of when the same person has a skill to work on the shoots and on the final material. Only then, with the final work, you can tell exactly what you wanted to tell. Let's see what techniques were used here and how to make same cool effects. The video begins with the pass in front of the camera effect, not just appearing or not just with a simple fade effect. This technique seems to say, hey, it is some piece of time in everyday life and the camera is standing here for a long time. Then some subjects shoots and the portrait. The face is not in the center. It is located on the principles of first, so then we can clearly see the lips and eyes, the eyes she talks to us. Leonardo will continue to use portraits in this work, because no one will tell you about the place better than those who were born and lived there. But how to make the video from the Johnny doesn't turn into a cutting of moments. In addition to a single cycle called cinematic line, Leonardo combines moments through using same direction. He's going up, like over here, we can say book and then hand. Spiral, like over here. Zoom out and spinning, zoom in from left to right and from right to left. So the frames itself tells him what direction to use. In addition to changing steam through the same direction, also a few interesting techniques have been used. Same color. We can see color over here is the same as over here. Overlapping. Overlaying. Items in front of the camera plus same direction. And a lot of motion blur. Also, in post-processing, there are several effects that can be done by using masks. Over here we can see forged patterns, which are possible generally a separate layer. And the water over here with a smooth mask. Micro moments. The author is an intelligent person with a good sense of humor. Shooting. How to shoot like Leonardo D'Alessandri? Let's say you are all right with the taste and ability to catch and see the moment. Here are a few tips that will help you to get the good stuff like the one we saw. Shoot from hands if you want to make dynamic and live footage. Use different angles to shoot on the same scene. Move the camera the same way as the scene you are shooting is moving. Details, details and more details. Do not end the shoot with the stop button. Move the camera in the desired direction so that you can make good transitions. Hyperlapse is our everything. Shoot objects from large to zooming out. Climb higher to shoot on the roof of the house or on a balloon. Use vertigo effect. Sound. The main musical theme is Experience by Ludovico Ainaudi. It is clearly woven real sounds from the filming, a woman's voice, wind basses, and a huge palette of turkey sounds. Lovely sound design. 
everything is harmonious. Complete unity with the video. Summarizing, there is everything to make me feel shivers. I really like the works in which the end is at the beginning, all as in life, everything is cyclical, and a huge number of smooth, smart transitions turning different stories of 20 days of travel into a single 3 minutes video. The work Watch Out of Turkey is an example of excellent decorative taste, scene merging, and a good sound design. All this fits into one person. Thank you, Leonardo D'Alessandri, for the opportunity to fill powerful land. Please let me know if I need to keep making white so cool videos and immerse you in the technical aspects. Your feedback is very important to me. Cheers, pasibo!